Like, can we stop with the misogyny already? If hair on a woman bothers you, it's because you're not a man yet. People were not born bare. And do you know how expensive feminine razors are? I guess so. Today's video is a quick one. I want to talk about Rachel McAdams getting a bunch of shit for unshaven armpits. I don't understand how we're in 2023 and still feel like it's gross and disgusting to have unshaven armpits. Like, first of all, if that's the case, then why aren't we disgusted by the fact that no man, or hardly any men, shave their armpits? Like, can we stop with the misogyny already? Also, this isn't the first female actress that has been pictured with unshaven armpits. Julia Roberts did it in like the 1990s. I wanted to go through a couple of Twitter responses to this whole thing. So New York Post said that Ray Rachel McAdams' armpit hair sparks mixed reaction. That's just nasty. So people were saying like, I love her as an actress, but this is not feminine at all. It just looks wrong. And then the reply to this is perfect. Everything about these pictures scream feminine energy, but let's focus on the small amount of hair you can barely see under her arm. I literally had to look at this image twice to even realise she has hair on her arms. If hair on a woman bothers you, it's because you're not a man yet. And someone replied, facts. I will say that the amount of men that say like, oh, this is disgusting. There's definitely internalised misogyny with women to also turn around and say this, this is disgusting. And that it's unnatural. Like People were not born bare from the neck down. To the point where some people think that arm hair is disgusting. People think that armpit hair is disgusting. Or that if you don't shave your legs, you're gross. The maintenance, like keeping everything shaved, is fucking so... It's time consuming. It's like sometimes so unnecessary. It's itchy. And you go through razors or like waxing strips so quickly. And do you know how expensive feminine razors are? I will say it's one thing I've really genuinely enjoyed about being single. I don't have to shave unless I fucking want to. Which sometimes I can go two weeks without shaving my legs. Because it's fucking winter. Who the fuck is seeing my legs? Except for me. No one. She is such a stunning woman and of course societal standards have to point out one of the most natural things. Like, did we forget we're human? Humans have armpit hair. Shocker. Literally, like, Misa, completely agree. So your groin and armpit areas have different sweat glands that can get nasty with more hair. If a revolution in science created a mix for this, I can see the trend changing. There's no science. Want to signal you stink? Go right ahead. Go wild. Okay. First of all, again, men don't shave their armpits. So if you're saying that armpit hair makes every single person stink, can you look at fucking men first? I've known people that have never even trimmed and it is long, easily that long. Men also are not pressured into shaving down there. So are we saying that they also stink? Female vaginas have natural bacteria, which does actually clean them. There has been science showing that if a woman literally just stops washing down there, the natural bacteria will keep it cleaner than soap would. Can we just stop with this? Gentlemen, a real woman, not waxed nor trimmed. I personally don't see an issue, even though manscaping is not foreign to me. Yeah, this is the other thing, like the amount of men that think that a woman should be completely fucking shaved, but do nothing downstairs themselves. And I mean, like, have never, touched it not trimmed or shaved ever and to the point where there was shits and gigs podcast they turned around and said to a guy who said that he didn't want his the girl to go down on him because it was a mess down there both of the guys this is the only part of one of their podcasts i was just like whoa what the fuck this is like really shameful like say this but they said that what's he doing like shaving or waxing or something down there i told a girl we can only kiss because i've got a bunch of ingrown hairs down there and it ain't cute <laughs> yeah. what's he doing? is he shaving <laughs> what? <laughs> is he shaving down there straight blade nah i must have ingrown hairs <laughs> <laughs> he's not on a trim thing, he's shaving yeah, he's it. Sh he's cleaning up. Nah, bro, what are you doing? It's like, sorry, you don't do anything, you don't trim, you don't like wax or like shave down there because because it's such double standards. They expect women to be completely bald or trimmed or whatever. Have like our legs shaved and like no toe hair and women have fucking toe hair just like men do. Have armpits completely shaved. To the point where I've been shaving my armpits since I was like, I want to say 13, 14. And because of that, I have to shave every day, if not every other day. Because it grows back so 
so incredibly quickly and it's so tiresome i mean eventually i may get to the point of when i'm older not at the moment but i may get to the point of like i'm not gonna fucking shave my legs i'm not gonna shave downstairs i'm not gonna shave my armpits i may get to that point in like 5 10 20 years i don't know i don't know the future because it's literally natural saying this is unnatural while also saying that men are allowed to be completely fucking natural is just ridiculous and it's internalized misogyny towards women. Like, just shut the fuck up. Just see if there's any other really good comments to include. I didn't even notice the armpit hair until you pointed it out. I am too busy staring at how gorgeous Rachel is and why she's not my wife yet. I wasn't staring at her thinking like, why she's not my wife? But yeah, I was too busy looking at her to even notice the arm hair. If it hadn't have been for the article pointing out and everyone pointing out in the comments, I ha wouldn't have noticed. Being grossed out by arm hair on a woman is strange, immature, and a level of controlling that is creepy. Making a gender of people feel that the hair that naturally goes on their legs and arms makes them gross unless they shave it off. Grow up, people. Anyway, I just wanted to quickly like this video because I just find this rhetoric completely ridiculous and unbearable. So yeah, if you like this video, please give this video a like and subscribe if you feel like it. I'd really appreciate it. I'm trying to post once a week. Things are getting a little bit busy again, so I apologise if it is more, a bit more sporadic, but I try to keep to at least once a week. I was keeping to twice a week at one point, but I've been struggling. So um, I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye.